Hey, my friend, welcome to this episode of the Daily Writer Podcast. We writers are a safe bunch. Business tycoons love the art of the deal. Sports figures love the rush of physical conflict, and skydivers love the sight of the ground rushing toward them, sentencing them toward certain doom unless their parachute opens. And you might actually like all those areas of excitement, but there's a good chance that when it comes to your writing, you're probably playing it safe. So what does it mean to play it safe as a writer? It means that you avoid sharing a controversial viewpoint when you feel convicted about it. It means you're not willing to upset anybody. It means you don't say what you really think. It means that you refuse to share the parts of your story that could really help somebody, even though it has some unsavory parts. At its worst, playing it safe means not sharing yourself at all. Playing it safe is an illusion. Whenever we play it safe, we're avoiding perceived conflict or judgment. In the end, however, if you don't share your work, if you don't share your heart, that's the most unsafe place to be. It means that you haven't made a difference and you haven't shared your authentic self. And that's not the place that you want to be. So my advice would be to not play it so safe. Share what you need to share and be brave and be bold. But by all means, don't play it safe. Here's today's question. Are you playing it safe in your writing? And if so, what could you do to be more brave and bold? Thanks so much for listening to today's episode. I want to take a moment to let you know about our daily writer membership community. You know, one of the very best ways to develop better habits and impact more people's lives with your writing is to spend time around other successful writers. So if you're tired of feeling isolated and chasing success on your own, then I know you're going to love the daily writer community. For years, I searched for the kind of writing community that I would want to join, but I could never find what I wanted, so I created my own. Some of the features include weekly writing sprints, monthly community calls, book discussions, calls with guest experts, and much more. For more info, you can visit dailywriterlife.com community. Thanks, and I'll see you tomorrow.